and hello everyone and welcome back to more the world of magic whip my brand new warrior well not brand new um seeing as i did a let's play about my ranger dave 11 a few years ago i decided to start one for each and every class in the game only for the general levels of like level 5 all the way to level 15 just showing people where to go what to do um but sadly after i got my pet i kind of got a little carried away and i went way past level 5 so if you some of you want to actually review those old videos you absolutely wonderfully can but for the matter now, I'm going to talk about why I have not been uploading. <laughs> Which is, I'm pretty sure, only a few people are wondering about. Um, so, if you haven't seen my community page on my YouTube, which I now have one again, thanks from the YouTube Partner Program that came out about way, way back when I first started the YouTube channel. Well, this is like my second one, because my first one... I'm gonna challenge it because my first one was um, deleted thanks to being a school email, you know. So that just happened. But then I made Dave, and now here we are. Now, um, basically, on to why I've been recording. So I've had a lot of problems with a water problem almost near flooding my house due to flash floods in front of my house. Um, so basically what's happening is that the water is getting compiled in front of the ditch in front of my house, where it's supposed to go through one side, then come out the next, and there's not supposed to be too many problems. Oh my god, nope. There we go. So, um... What is that? What I needed to do? So I'm getting like distracted by this bulldozer looking at my health. So what's happening is that what I need to do? I need to push the water besides my house because I'm living on a hill. So it would come down in front of my house, then it would kind of flow up to my front door and my other door. So I haven't been able to make videos because I've had to go outside to push the water from the front of my door, my front door my bedroom door and push it beside my house so it can go down the hill of my driveway and it doesn't you know, come to my house like it did last time. So I haven't been able to upload for like two weeks because there's been a storm like every five days or a few days after that. But now here we are. You know, the problem is I guess I have to sweep water from the front of my house every time it starts to uh, get out of control, but I guess since it only happened two times, I'm not really worried about it. Please die, bulldozer. Thank you. Did you drop anything? Nope. Okay. But I should be fine now. So we decided to start a warrior let's play from level 6 all the way to level 15. The reason why I'm doing level 15, and I always have done level 15, as like in my older videos, is because it's generally the level that where people don't really get to, and it's pretty much where you get cool skills such as Carnivalize, Slim. Um, I don't think Rangers. Oh yeah, and you also have Swift, I guess, for critting, which is very good for Rangers because they have a lot of going damage and they need to keep up with the arrows that they can spam for. But yeah, basically this is gonna be my new character only up to level 15. After that I'm just gonna go straight back into <laughs> well I guess I'm thinking about doing a mage for now. But I'm not 100 percent sure on that. If I ever do a mage, it might be a dual mage, which I thought about doing with my brother, but we shall have to see. As far as this counter goes, um, well, honestly, I would have done it with Dave, but I thought to myself, 
Is full strength really gonna get people that far? Mm, I mean, maybe if you know a lot about the game, but I better just go full con just in case. So, that's what we're doing right now. That's why we have 100 HP at level 6, because we have 18 con and 14 strength. So I just put a whole bunch of points in the con until level 16, and then the rest went into my strength. No other skill, skill points have been upgraded. As far as skills, you can see, ever since comps to us added, the numbers on the side of your screen, you can now see what skills I have. The level 1 sweeping, oh, sorry, not sweeping strike, wild swing, and level 1 hemorrhage. We plan to get parry and um, counter attack at a later later point, but for now, we're just, gonna, we're just gonna leave those things how they are. As far as gear goes, pretty much anything that I can find, so like what I have on generally, wooden shield, and my fairy robe are things that I found. I got my kitty cat ears from my day account, because I never use them. I literally never put on those things. And I only change into my maid dress whenever I'm doing videos. So I don't know, I might wear might that, I don't know, I guess. Which is why I do it for like Battlefield videos. So yeah. Um, I might redo my pet video one day. Speaking of which about that. Seeing how it's been like an actual pain to get anything done about that. Since my sound was kind of like quiet on there, I couldn't hear myself as I thought I did. So, yeah. Definitely gonna have to do that all over again. Um, not sure. But, luckily, what I plan to do with these, you know, let's plays after I'm done with my warrior, I can start on my mage level 15, level five to 15. Not sure if people actually like the level 1 part of the game, because you know, it's like just super easy just sitting in one map the whole time. Which is basically like pretty much any other level, like what I'm at right now. You know, you just kill cooies, then you kill, um, rainbow bushes, after that you're just killing boars. That's pretty much how it was. I mean, I got my pet, yes, but that's pretty much about it. I don't even have the... I don't think I have the ring. No, I don't. So... I'm probably gonna have to go pick that up. Maybe... Maybe later. As far as these videos will go, um... I don't know the link that I want for these type of videos. I was thinking about just recording as long as I can. So, like, up to... I don't know, maybe 30 minutes to make as much progress for everyone. Maybe that you guys can fast forward through these videos, you know, just check out points that where you guys want to train and stuff. Maybe, I don't know. <laughs> mm -mm -mm. For now, we're just gonna kill flower elementals and what are these mushrooms? Swamp mushroom spores? I believe so. No, oh. must be thinking about the wrong place. But yeah, for level 5, you will kill swamp mushrooms. For level 6, you will kill flower elementals. For level 7, um, I think we will move over to spiders, but I'm not sure. We might have to get new skills for that. Just to make sure that I'm uh, caught up. Why does mushroom come over here? I'm just looking at it. But anyways, thanks to this pet, this should go a lot faster from when I did my Let's Play a long time ago with Dave, my Ranger. Because I have a pet with Deadly on it. Which, yes, I did make a video on how to get the little Kui at the beginning of the game. And, yes, you can get it at level 1, but... I think that you won't be able to, I don't think that, um, you'll be able to kill boars at level 1. <laughs> That's where I think it comes from, so, you could if you wanted to, but... 
I think it does require a little bit of leveling up. Since there is no level cap on it, but there is a... I mean, sorry, not a level cap. Because there is no, like, level bound on it, so you have to be a level to get it. Um, hmm. Flower killing. Pretty much not much that I can say about this. Yep, just a whole entire training series. Oh my god, we're actually, wow, we're actually eating a lot more deadlies than I expected. Two deadlies right there, oh, they're really critical. I don't even have the high decks or anything, it's just, these are just normal stats, like normal level crazy stats. Oh, well, I guess my kitty cat ears are helping me with armor, but other than that, just block, fire resistance, which doesn't really matter at my current level, and then rusty sword. So... All that we're pretty much hitting with. Also, the I think the event is going on right now where you get the EXP and attack buff. So this is pretty much a good time that I picked to level up a new character for. And just like my Dave, I don't I don't know. Just like my Dave Ranger, I don't know what's gonna happen with this account after I'm after I reach level 15. I don't know. Maybe I might keep it? I have no idea. But the whole point of this is just so that way I can look back and update these as time goes on. And maybe Comstars will be able to learn a little bit. So, you know, if my first episode of my Warrior gets a whole bunch of likes, then I might do um, um, more of these. All the way up to level 20, and then maybe 30, and level 40, and then 50, I don't know. But it'll only depend on after after I reach each and every character up to level 15. After that, I plan to do Lano's side as well. Because, you know, different mobs. Not exactly the same place. Though I might not do Mushroom Marshall. Because, you know, it's just the same mob, same training over and over again. I have no idea. I would want to cut these videos, but... I actually like how my long videos are, you know. I enjoy these videos, and I think that's just about what, it, what really matters whenever I record. It's like, you know, as long as you enjoy the content that you make, it doesn't really matter what everybody else thinks. But, you know... Ideas are always in place, so, which is why comments exist. Oh wow, okay. I was about to go 2v1 this flower, but then I saw this mushroom. So, we shall kill him first. Goodbye. Thank you very much. And you know what? I should probably do something with these little feathers. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. I'm just Speaking of which, once I reach level 8, which I hope to do soon, um. I plan to probably just put Dave Levin's costumes on here. Because I cannot see myself wearing a face dress on a neck too much longer. Because there's too much problem with that. I am not out on that idea. Oh uh, yeah, and I was also like blacklisting a bunch of people. So, which is probably why you don't see a lot of talking in the chat. Either they're blacklisted because of the past, like something they said, or 
I just forgot to unblacklist them. But really, I don't ever. I don't even blink at my, my blacklist. Like, I just put people all in there, and then they're just on there. Which I will definitely have to start removing one. Okay, I got a call. They finally hung up. I hope they didn't mess up anything. Oh my god. This is like gonna be the second video that I record and then the sound messes up. Oh, I can already feel the lag in between. I might have to stop the recording, even though it's only 15 minutes long. I've been removing a... Oh my god, the lag here. Why is it doing this? I've been removing a lot of things on my recording device. This is gonna be this one. And I'm gonna make my second device my... Well, my main device. <laughs> so, this one will be for pretty much primarily recording, so that way I can make like one hour, two hour videos, then edit them. Because luckily my phone has a lot of space, so I can record up to like two hour to three hour videos with no problems until it starts like, you know, dropping frames or something goes wrong. But if anything like happens in the middle of the video, like a call or something, it might mess up. Just hope that this video is not gonna be like that. I don't know why people even call me. Like I literally tell them, "Oh yes, my day is off today. I don't want to be called. Just want to relax." And, you know, boop, I get a phone call. Each and every video, then I have to remake the video. That's exactly what happens to my commentary videos and my update videos is. I make one, and if I get a phone call in it, something happens to the recording, and I have to remake it all over again. So something won't be picked up in it. Then I have to put music in the background, or I don't know. So many unexpected things are happening, which is most likely why people who record videos like very often do it in like a secret space. Which I'm not sure a lot of people have, so... It really depend on that. Alright, let's get to level 7 in this video. That should be fine enough before we get our new skills. Cause I have 3k. And if I need more, I think I can just add popcorn to my other account. And get more money from it. Okay, there we go, level seven. Oh, wait a minute. Wait, that was a new level up sound. They, they give a little ring to it, like ding. I don't think that was the mage that you guys just heard. I think that was actually a level up sound. Um. Oh my God. This fly, it's annoying me. It's not actually bothering me or anything on me. It's actually flying just, you know, like around where I am. So it hasn't even, it's not in my area, but it's just too close. Like it's just bothering me, just that I see it. Oh, well I guess the bugs deserve to be free too, but then again, there are boundaries. All right, let's go get my new skills, hopefully. Um, where are you, Mr. Rita Island? Thank you very much. All right. Let's see. So, I have 4K. Um, so what skills do I plan to get? First off, for this warrior, I mean, I guess if it goes to level 30, I might think about getting Wild Strikes 4. I might. But, for now... 
Wild Swing 3, Hammer is going to be deleted. We're going to upgrade Parry to level 2, which I think is the max. Counter Attack 3. Um, you know, I guess we'll go to Wild Charge and Jazzy Blue and Rush later. Pretty much all the way up to where I guess we'll whatever we can. This is not going to be an all skill level warrior. <laughs> That's what everybody's thinking, you know. It would be if I plan to put any like hardcore PvP on this character, but never going to be the case. Uh, where's my. Did I just pass by my other book? Oh, don't. Okay, here we go. Alright, now we have a level 7 big gift box. We have to open it. I hope I didn't buy any skills that this box would have given me. Did I? Um, we get a level 8 adventurer sword, which is actually a lot better in terms of attack than my rusty sword. Attack 1 through 3, speed 1.2 to attack 4 to 12, speed 1.2, crit 1. So, yeah. Just gives you guys an idea, I guess, of what comes to us once we build on our character. Which, most definitely, I will not be building crit. Alright, so now we have 80% additional. Um, let me see here. Oh, yeah, Adventure Cloak. We have that. So we have other things for level 8, which I will be stacking into a certain bag. Alright, there we go. Okay. Alright, did I miss anything? 1.3, I guess we can get parry. I mean, counterattack. How much is it? 2k? Oh, it's not that bad. Yeah. So let's get parry right now. Which I mean, obviously, if you have a shield, you'll automatically just gain the ability to parry. So you don't really. Oh crap, why am I. Get out of your bags. So you don't actually, you know, have to get parry. But just for the sake of it, we will just have such a Okay, so we have to think about what to sell here, which I guess this, I guess we can cap this as part of the let's play, you know, because thinking about what you need to do and what to sell would be good for a beginning player. Or if you're an old player and you just like watching these videos, then hello, welcome. Alright, so lesser potions, we don't need those because we get less restoration potions from these guys which are sold on so you can't fill them. Green powder we can keep this but since we're lower level we don't exactly need something like that. Magic extraction venture certificate okay old feather yeah these things are useful mushroom spore we don't need that oh wait no no we're not gonna do that quest we're not gonna Alright, so seeds. Yeah, we don't need those either. Fill them on Black Trader or just keep them in your inventory. I think. No, wait, I think it's mystical seeds that you need for the lighthouse. Uh, I haven't been in the lighthouse in like five years. I don't go in there anymore. It's like just dead. I, I don't know. I don't ever go in there. Okay, rune leather. Uh, we're not gonna craft anything with that book. Lollipop, we don't really need. Because we have novice bandages right here. The box needs to go in the first one. My, my first thing. Mystical seeds will be useful for the lighthouse, but we can't go that far on the floor anyway. So this ain't gonna be level, level 25, let's play, unless we get to level 30. Venture sword, my costumes. Um. Dry mushroom, we don't need that. Let's just cooey down. We don't need that. That's just for money. And it now this is compilation book. Which I don't think sells for anything, but I think if you buy the other books, they do sell for something like this one. What's that? 100k? 500. I thought they I thought that was like 1 million. Did it change the price? 
could have sworn something around here was one billion. Okay, well, whatever. Coolio. Alright, this is 25 minutes. We're not gonna sit around here and waste your time. So, I will see you. Yeah, alright, let's just get to a, a sign out point to where I can start my next video and review this footage and see if I was actually recording the sound of this video. So, goodbye everybody, and I will see you guys in the next video.